Hi-Fi subwoofers versus home theater? This question comes from Thomas in the United Kingdom. Such an official sounding thing, isn't it? Hi, Paul. I come from a family of classical musicians, so I don't know if I'm just an oddball or not. <laughs> I don't think you're an oddball, for goodness sakes. Um, but I swear that wherever I place my subwoofer, or whatever gain or crossover I use, I can locate the damn thing. Mm -hmm. uh, it wrecks the soundstage for me. Yep, you're a good listener. When the recordings are proper stereo-based concert hall recordings. I'm considering going to a pair of fast 10-inch subwoofers, for example, the Rel T9Is, with high-level inputs, as home theater is a secondary consideration for me. Would I be better served by staying with the RELs for two channel and then adding a dedicated large ported subwoofer for the LFE channel and spending some time integrating that with the rest of the system? Well, this is, wait, sorry, I couldn't resist. Yesterday we were sitting in the Rose Garden. Today we're kind of walking, see our little, our little birdhouse. We get, we get customers for our birdhouse. It's got many levels, I think one, two, three, four. So it's got like eight little chambers where birds go in and have their babies in, in the spring. This is just a lovely part of our backyard. We don't have a big backyard. It might look like it on the camera, but um, hey, you know, it's, it's pretty sweet back here. Okay. Um, this is always, you know, I don't want to sound like a broken record, but you, you all know You've heard me say this how many times in the past. Subwoofers are designed to disappear. We don't want to know where the subwoofer is. And this gentleman um, correctly identifies the fact that when he turns his sub on, he hears it as a separate entity, which destroys all the beauty that a subwoofer has to offer, which is the illusion that your main speakers have bass. That's what we're looking for. We want this realistic foundation that music cries out for, especially classical music. Oh, God. There's, I can't think of anything more exciting than a fully subwoofered system playing classical music. And you know what's funny about that? People come to me and they go, well, wait a minute. Nothing in an orchestra has any frequency, no instrument that goes lower than, I don't know, 30, 40 hertz, um, except maybe a pipe organ, right? And very few orchestras have pipe organs. So who cares? What difference does it make? And it is so missing the point. It's not the instruments, it's everything else, the environment that makes us believe we're in that space and that's what a subwoofer is so good at. But if you hear the sub, done, right? So yeah, I think your plan on going for a pair of high-level fed uh, T, uh, the, the, what are those, the little 10-inch rails, which is what I have in my house, is a great idea. So the high-level bit, what that means is you're taking the output of your power amplifier and placing that as the input to the subwoofers, which also helps make them disappear. Now the other trick for that is going to be to keep your crossover frequency on the rails down. So what you want to do is turn it as low as you can and then start playing music and then turning the crossover up, up, up in frequency until you start to hear the sub, then turn it down to where it disappears. That's going to be your trick. The last part of your question is for your home theater setup, which is secondary, do you want to add another sub, like a big ported job for the LFE channel? Nah, just keep the, the let me tell you something. If you set this thing up right, you don't need that LFE channel. Your system will be just fine the way it is. Now, you can do it if you want, but I wouldn't. I would just set it up so that on my home theater system, in the setup menu, everything is playing full range. They call them big speakers. Whether you have big speakers or not, use the big speaker setting so that you have full range and then connect these subs up. Life will be good out there in the UK. All right. Thanks. I'll talk to you later. Bye.